act like you care. <sighs> Fine. Come on. Huh? <sighs> Who got off? Is this some weirdo? He has a lot of keys. He must hey, be important. Uh, are you sure it's him, or are you just that self-conscious? <coughs> I'm not that. Is there something you want? <laughs> That's my line. You are the one stalking me. Stalking you? That's outrageous. I know I'm too flamboyant and ever beautiful. Ever since the train. That's because. <laughs> My goodness, I had wondered. It's the guy from the flash forward. This is where your passion led. All is well that ends well. Ha 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 ha. My son's going to prison. I saw you from the car, and I couldn't help myself from chasing after you. <gasps> That's Kratos! I didn't even notice the calls from Sensei. But thank goodness I caught up to you. That has to be Kratos. And no, not from God of War. That's Kratos. I'm talking about Kratos from Tales of Symphonia. Okay. Okay. What? You're the woman I've been searching for all this time. Please. Won't you? Complete opposite of his uh, personality, though. The Kratos. W wait a minute. I... Be the model for my next art piece. Oh, okay. Model? All that I've drawn till now has been lacking, but I feel a passion from you unlike anyone else. Probably because she's the only one wearing red. Like, literally everyone else is wearing black, blue. This man's highly suspicious. I agree. I mean, if we can join her in the production of the art, Ain't this a recruit for some shady business? I swear it's not naked art. Will you cooperate with me? What do you say? Whoa, hold your horses. Who are you anyways? <coughs> oh, where are my manners? I'm a second year at Kosei High's Fine Arts Division. My name is Yusuke Kitagawa. Yusuke, eh? I'm Matarame Sensei's pupil, and I am being allowed residence at his place. I'm striving to become an artist. Huh? Do you mean that, Matarame? The one who was on Good Morning Japan the other day? The very same. They have a Good Morning program, too? You know who that I mean, is? I guess that makes sense. He was introduced as a super famous Japanese-style artist who's been recognized all over the world. Uh, but we heard that name the other day in Mementos. Uh-oh. Yusuke! I'm sorry, Sensei. I'll be right there. That old guy's Matarame? Matarame Sensei's exhibition will begin at the department store near the station tomorrow. I'll be there to help out on opening day. Please come by. It'd okay. be great if you could give me your answer in regard to being a model then. I bet you have no interest in the fine arts, but I'll give you tickets too. Well, thanks for shitting all over me. Well then, I hope to see you there tomorrow. Guys, as easy to read as a book. Hmm. You're not planning on going, are you? I think I will. Something to do. Crap, but look at the time. I'll see you later. Now you see us together. We need Can't to run to school, too. Lady on. I've memorized that face of yours, Yusuke. It'd be hard not to memorize. He's like the only guy we've met so far with blue hair that hasn't existed in the Velvet Room. No, wait, actually, no one in the Velvet Room has blue hair. It's just a blue area. Is there a reason you're cutting off my excellent story? You became acquainted with Matarame's pupil by chance? No, by reverse osmosis. Since That's I know a little Anne. too convenient. It makes me wonder if you're even telling the truth. So be it. 
What I want to know most is your method. It's true that Madarame was an unforgivable criminal worthy of the scorn thrown at him. Mm, spoilers. He was an adult who cultivated his own fame and fortune by sacrificing the livelihood of children. Oh, God. Uh-oh. But how did you discover such horrible deeds that were hidden all these years in such a short time? Ah, uh, you know, Alice's. Eh. Fine. Let's suppose that people's hearts can be changed by stealing their treasure, like you've said. If so, a different suspicion arises. <clears throat> People have gone mad or lost consciousness, never to recover, like the subway accident in April. Depending on how you look at it, that could be taken as a phenomenon for a sudden change of heart, too. Were you related to those as well? Eh, I don't want to say. Eh. Hmm, I see. <clears throat> Fine. Continue telling me about Madarame's case. Keep it concise and only of the truth. And stop telling me about the goddamn days you went to the bath and didn't do anything else. That's a waste of time. And today I took the Big Bang Birther challenge again. Fucking stop telling me this! Anyway. Let's see what we got. Another feeling of Ryuji. That's because I've literally never bothered to study because I do fine without... Yeah, I, I sort of get that. I just don't do well with studying. It's just nothing, something I've never really done. I do, I do tolerable enough to pass. Beneficial or annoying in terms of the plot? Um, I think they're interesting. I think it is a little dumb that she revealed who the next guy we're going to be going after is. I, I do feel like they should have waited. Overall, though, I, I don't mind it too much. I find it kind of silly that every single time, like, we're about to get our first social link with a person, she's like, So, this is someone you knew, huh? And then nothing really comes out of it and just, like, cuts back. That's a little silly. I don't think they needed to cut that many times. Anyway. Today is the last day of exams, huh? Hey, stop writing. Get it together. This is a disaster. You're going to be in trouble if you don't start studying regularly. That's me being oblivious for you. Are we done? Oh, I didn't even have to answer anything. Mm, it's over. The most relaxing feeling in the fucking world. Whether or not you passed or you failed, you've done your exams. And you're just like, fuck, I'm done. I'm out. It's over. Yeah, that feeling is beautiful. I know it too well. How about you? Eh. I'm not worrying about it. I mean, I, I kind of am. It's over. Come on, you two need to get your act together. Anyways, can we stop talking about the exams? Like it or not, they're gonna come back graded next week. Yeah. Rather than focus on stuff that's over with. What are you looking at? The usual site. <coughs> it's no use. There ain't any useful info. Number of posts are getting less and less too. I am not letting this end as a one-hit wonder, okay? There's no point in getting antsy, though. I know. Why don't we go eat lunch somewhere? We still have some money left over from the other day. Who wants to take the challenge with me? I want sushi then. Or domestic raised eel. Domestic raised eel. Only in Japan. We don't have that much left. Oh, right. There are those tickets to Matarame's exhibit. Wait, that's tomorrow. Dummy. You can't eat art. Don't tell me. Was it love at first sight with that Yusuke guy? Don't worry. I promise you still have a chance. You don't have a chance. It's not like that. Oh, of course not. When I was watching that special on TV, his artwork was pretty nice. Plus, we've got free tickets. You can't eat art, and Besides, this could also be related to <clears throat> what we heard in Mementos. Matarame, was it? I'm curious. Hmm. That aside, what should I do about the other two tickets? Wanna go appreciate some fine arts for once? I mean, hey. Fine arts, huh? Fine arts, my ass. I suggest we should all go together. Okay, good suggestion. Appreciating the fine arts builds character. A phantom thief who can't identify an original is lame. 
yeah, I mean, what the, the ultimate original Phantom Thief, uh, Reed, or Red, the fox from uh, Animal Crossing. Dude, that fucker will swindle you if you don't realize what you're doing. Well, if everyone's going... It's settled, then. Eh, I'm looking forward to it. Just the phrase, going to an art exhibit, sounds kind of mature. No, it kind of sounds like we're bored and we have literally nothing else to do with our day. Let's meet at the exhibit entrance tomorrow. But hey, I'm all for these days, because on these days, I have some schedule that can't be shit on by Zuper and Jaden. It's perfect. It's flawless. They can't be like, Ross, why are you going to that art exhibit? I'm like, I'm, I'm forced to go to the art exhibit. Oh, what was me? Okay. Uh, you're going to force me to bed? Better get to bed early. So I kept thinking about what Nakanarahara said. Bleh. Could he have been talking about the famous artist Madarame? Nice sketch. Well, it is a pretty rare last name. Yeah, I mean, you guys ever heard of someone calling Madarame? No, not really. It's really not common at all. If what we heard is true, Kitagawa kun is studying under a corrupt teacher. You mean a teacher who treats people like tools? Kitagawa. These fucking names. Kitagawa kun's life is probably pretty terrible. We gotta look into this. It's Yusuke. Who she's talking about, I believe. Well then. I'll be sure to escort Lady Anne tomorrow. Can I escort this plant? Yes! Finally! Give me that kindness. Good. After all this time, I'm still at like 2 2 1 1 1. Alright. It should do for a while. TV? Next up, entertainment. An exhibit featuring Japanese artist That Person opens tomorrow in Shibuya. Anticipation for the exhibition is high with special broadcasts on TV and great ticket sales. Hey, it's that old guy. I didn't think he would actually be famous. I thought Anne was a lying little. Anyway. I'll just add this. I'll just add this. Dear Diary, today I finished my exams. Uh, let's see be able to feed the plant by now. Exams ate up like a week. Yeah, seriously. Anyway, I'm going to take a quick break. Uh, what can I leave you guys with for a good break video? Let's find out if I have anything. Uh, do we have any good break videos? I don't think I do. Uh, let's check the video. What do we have here? Nope, I don't got any break videos, so instead I'm just going to leave you with the uh, stream cutaway. That's good enough for now. Alright. There we go. Stream cutaway. Back in a bit. Actually, is there, is there any sound coming off of this? That's another question I have. I, I, I guess there is. I hope there is. Anyway. If there's no sound coming off that, tell me. No, there's no sound. Okay, in that case, let's uh, try rewinding it. No. Stream only? Really? Sound just died on the video. <laughs> that's, that's cute. Weird. I don't know why the sound died. Well, I don't even have that to listen to anymore. So instead you get, uh, the, this. That doesn't have sound either. Oh, damn it. Uh, weird. All right. Now I need to try something if that's not going to, what if I do this? There's no sound there either. Weird. Off my mouse. Weird. Very weird. Alright, well then I guess you guys just get to hear the music then. That works. Listen to that. That works.
Oh, heck, says them. Did she just try to fucking pyramid in my goddamn chat and fail? Well, you know what that means. I don't care how long ago that happened, but heck, you done hecked up. Uh, let's go for the, uh, uh, in Jane's message. Oh, oh no, nope, that, that doesn't work. Okay, you got removed from timeout. Uh, don't mess up pyramids in my chat. That is, uh, that's a no-no. If you're gonna commit, you better do it. Jaden, you got kicked out. What are you talking about? Granny Chan's uh, uh, peanut and rice bowl. So, I feel a little bit Japanese right now. Don't oversleep. Alright, let's sleep. Any praise for the one you did right earlier? Oh, it's not about getting them right. I don't, I don't care if you get them right. I'll never reward you for getting them right. I'll be like, okay. But if you get them wrong, I'm sure as shit gonna destroy you. That is that is the logic. That's how it works. What's this line for? Oh, that exhibition must be opening today. It's really packed. Wanna come back another time? I mean, I want, but it's expensive. Maybe I should take out a loan. I wanna see that. Let's go sometime. I mean, I, I would I would reward you if I was actually popular, but if there's only three people. And one of those three people is Zuper, who literally could not give less of a shit. So crowded. It doesn't really, uh, doesn't really count. Yeah, don't, don't post pyramids in my chat. Yeah, yeah, you, you got it. Good. See, Zuper picks on pretty fast. It'll be a pain in the ass if someone sees you, so don't stick your head out too much. All right? Yeah, he's an art piece. Don't worry about him. You came. Oh. Um. Yeah. You really came? Yes. What'd you expect when you left us those tickets? Make sure that you don't get in the way of the other visitors. I'll get all in their way. Come now. I'll show you around. I'd like to speak more about the picture I'd like to draw. Well, see you guys later. Uh, keep the mace. Will Lady Han be alright? What if he drags her behind some painting and tries something funny? I told you not to come out. <laughs> Are we really gonna appreciate the fine arts? Can't we just go home? No, we gotta be here. Let's be learning about Matarame. I guess we should do a quick pass through at once. Uh, which way are we supposed to start? Well, first off, we start with the painting on the far left, then we go all the way down to the one on the far right. Hmm? Oh, well, there he is right What's there. It's that old man from the other day. Darn it, almost gotten to appreciate the fine arts. We continue to be truly surprised by your imagination. You have such expansive <laughs> styles. <laughs> it's hard to believe that it all stems from one person. Where in the world does all your inspiration come from? Oh, I'm just better than everyone else. Palace formed. Well, 
It is rather difficult to put into words. They naturally well up from within my heart, like bubbles rising one after another in the spring. Naturally, yes. you say? What's important is to distance oneself from worldly desires, such as money and fame. My atelier is a modest shack, but it is more than enough to pursue true beauty. So the act of emptying one's mind gives rise to inner beauty. Still, to think we could hear the word shack coming from the great artist Madarame. What's, what's so special about the word shack? You would understand if you saw it. <laughs> it's probably going to be some Wasn't the word mention. shack something? Madarame-san is actually here? Over there! I'm so glad I came on opening day. Hey, stop pushing! Ugh, there's way too many people! I'm getting crushed! It's okay, Morgana, you're with it. We gotta head for the exit! Don't die on us, alright? I didn't know there were so many types of Japanese art. What the fuck? Who drew a picture of Morgana? Usually, one concentrates on That's their That's a real style. sneaky Morgana right there. However, Sensei creates all this by himself. He's special. There you are, Yusuke. Now, stop hitting on women and get to drawing. Sensei! Ah, the girl from yesterday. Are you enjoying the exhibit? Despite being very wealthy and famous. There's a famous uh, writer who did the exact same thing. Uh, I'm drawing a total blank on his name. He's like the American writer. Let me look it up real fast because it's going to bother me. American writer lived in a shack. Walden. And also, or uh, Henry David Thoreau. Yeah. Thoreau is a pretty cool guy. I don't know how to put it into words, but it's really amazing. This is a very naturalistic writer. You're sensing something from the artwork. That alone is enough to give us artists satisfaction. I hope this becomes a wonderful piece, Yusuke. Well then, if you'll excuse me. Oh, he seems awfully nice. So when does he turn? You'd imagine artists would be difficult to approach. But he seems really friendly. Indeed. He seems it. He's actually a massive oh, cunt. This is it. The painting I wanted to see in person. This one? I guess it's the painter's anger? I'm not sure, but I sense this strong frustration from it. This must be how we enter the, uh, the next palace. To think such a cheerful and gentlemanly person could make such a piece. <laughs> yeah. Something wrong? Don't mind me. Oh, there button. are better pieces than... Fuck! This one. Ah, that old lady totally elbowed me. Ah, she's probably entitled. Thanks to that, I remember now. What? What do you remember? Hmm. Let's not worry about it for now. Hmm. It's about a post online. Here, look at this. Why'd you leave without me? You got it all wrong. We got dragged into this huge crowd and... Eh, anyways, you gotta look at this too. This post might be about Madarame. What's it say? What does it say? A master of the Japanese arts is plagiarizing his pupil's work. Only his public face is shown on TV. Plagiarizing? I didn't Sounds think like much Yusuke of it when I first that. saw it, but hearing Shaq and Madarame triggered it. His treatment of the pupils who live with him is awful. He teaches nothing and bosses them around. He treats them inhumanely, as if disciplining a dog. Abuse on top of plagiarism, hmm? Huh? Yeah, plagiarism is the ultimate crime, actually. That makes him, like, way worse than Kamashita. I mean, I hate plagiarists, like, a lot. 
I think plagiarism is one of the fucking dumbest shit you can do. If this is real, don't it'll do be it. a huge scandal. Like for the love of God, that's a very serious pet peeve. Posted this. I mean, he is now a posting copyrighted his. music in my videos. That's okay. I mean, I'm not trying to earn money off of it. I'm not trying to present it. If I was actually trying to make like something presentable, I would not. No, 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 no. That's, that's plagiarism. Don't do that. Who knows? Or it's anonymous and all. Misuse of copyright. Misuse of copyright's a little bit weirder. In that case. Plagiarism is like making shit your own work and like pretending it's yours. That's the, the no, no, no. It's do possible that. the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is referring to the same one. A man like that doing such a thing? I wonder if we can ask that shadow from earlier about this. Oh, actually, we just need to talk to him in reality. And how are we gonna go about that? Are we gonna explain it all, starting with Mementos? Hmm. Besides, if we make a move out in the open, there's the possibility that Madarame will find out. Oh. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Hey, what do you think about Madarame? Doesn't he seem suspicious? Mm. I don't know. There's this much overlap. Ain't it pretty much settled? There's if plenty of other artists. artists. Legit, ain't this the kind of target we've been waiting for? Well, yeah, but is it really true? By the way, what did you do about the whole modeling thing? Kitago Akun gave me his contact info and the address to his sensei's atelier. He said he lives there, right? Perfect timing. Let's try going to Mara. We're off to Madarame's house right after school. And we're getting Gateline yet again. Huh? You want me to model tomorrow? Hell this yeah. Is too sudden. I gotta be good at We're it. just gonna go talk to Kitagawa. Oh, that's what you meant. Duh. And it's pretty cute. I like her. She's fun. Okay. In any case, we need to find out about that rumor about Madarame. If so, this might be exactly what we need. Am I allowed to go to. Hey! Our investigation on Madarame. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, that's why I thought. Okay. What? Let's go. Oh wait, it's a Sunday. Shit, don't sleep yet. The shopping channel. Four bags of protein. Hey, that's actually, oh my God, that is expensive. Uh, is that worth it? How good is the gym? How good is that gym? Let me know. But you want to get wet protein. Do I have enough money to get wet protein, though, to be fair? And can I just put it outside to get it wet? You could get some. Okay, I'll just get the four. Then. I mean, it's cheap. It's dirt cheap off shopping channel. Good. Well then. Plus, I hate to go to sleep. I, I need to like get a couple sticks in at Moran Mor Mor Morana. Yeah, Morgana. When I can, and prevent the sleep. Oh yes, the great artist Madarame is holding an exhibit at Shibuya right now, huh? Oh, I've gone to see his work a number of times. Goodness, are they magnificent. The moment I saw them, I knew he was something else. By the way, you seem far removed from the arts, Father. Oh, that was Here's me. a question. Do you know who created the piece which sold for the highest price back in the 20th century? Uh, that would probably be Van Gogh. That's correct! Thank you guy who wrote uh, American Pie, as well as his other song, Van Gogh. Uh, what the hell is this? Is it like 
D. McLean or something like that. Uh, McLean. Starry, starry night. Yeah. Don McLean. Not D. McLean. Don McLean uh, is Vincent, or Starry Starry Night. That's a really good song. I'd argue he only wrote just two good songs, because, I mean, most of the rest of them are kind of unmentionable. But Don McLean wrote this song. It's really fucking good. Yeah, I'm not going to play any more than that. I'll get copyright. But thanks to that, I guess I got this question correct. Cool. As a complete dick move, that history is different in this world. Well, Madarame wouldn't exist in the 20th century. They already mentioned that he was only a 21st century artist, so... Seems you know a thing or two after all. A piece was purchased for the equivalent of 18 billion yen and is sold for even more later. However, since the turn of the 21st century, a new record has been practically set every year. No hey, did you know that? I had no idea. That piece actually kind of smart. I'm kind of surprised. Oh, shoot, the teacher's glaring at us. Nice going. Wow, you must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. Wow, we. All this praise. Oh, fuck off! <laughs> God damn it. Well, we got another two. People put a serious amount of passion, art, and money. In, into money. Yeah, yeah, they do as well, but also into art. If I had that kind of money, I wouldn't have... Uh, wouldn't mind having a painting or two of myself. <laughs> hey, hey. Seems like art can make you a tidy sum. Let's see with our own eyes whether or not the accusation and stealing art are true. Meeting Landy Ann and the others at the train station, right? Let's go see when classes are out. Bullshit, it was one fucking goddamn point off. Come on. Phantom Thieves going by train. This ain't different from how I get to school, you know. Train's the fastest way to go. Plus, we can bring pets on here. No! Hey, who are you calling a pet? Dude, be quiet. We didn't pay the pet fare. I'm the one guiding you to your destination. You should be calling me Master. Hey! Oh, kitty! Uh, shoot. Is that your pet, mister? I heard it meowing. Yeah, it's a stuffed animal. Yeah, it's just a toy. It meows when you press on its head. Hey! You heard her, Ross. Press on its head. This is ridiculous. <sighs> Ew. Wowee, again, again! How the butt mash? <laughs> <laughs> that was so funny. I want to hear it again. I just threw up in my mouth. Seriously. The next stop is Shibuya Station. The doors will open on the left side. Oh, this is our stop. Well, see you later. Bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. I'm gonna get some serious shit for that later. It's just gonna be a normal day and we're gonna be like, Hey, guess what? Go to yeah. bed. So, which train line do we gotta transfer to? Doesn't look like any other station's close by that address. If anything, this is the closest station. For real? What? Ah, oh, shut up. Then we gotta walk the rest of the way? What kind of fan of thief takes the train and then walks to their destination? Stop your complaining. Okay. It's supposedly a sh- Oh, wow, well, I skipped all that. Sorry. Oops. And I can't actually go back in the conversation, son of a bitch. Unless I can do this. No, I can't. Madarame is seriously guilty. He's totally the perfect target. You chose wisely. Thanks. Oh, I forgot that... Ch I knew I was supposed to change that. Ah, uh, I'm too... I forgot to change the goddamn title. Uh, Alright, there you go. Alright, that's a pretty good one. Now you guys can reset the stream and it'll probably be the new title. Uh, that's a good title. Could 
a gentleman like that really be plagiarized and confusing his pupils? If it is really true, then Kitagawa could. Yeah, I feel bad for the dude. Ah, new vending machines. Oh, so much for that. No, oh, we have to actually go down. Yeah. God, I'm so good at this game. Go back! Put me back! I'm not done! Wait, this isn't anywhere new. I lied. Do we have to transfer to another line? Where else are we going? Hey Morgana, where am I going? Uh, head to Madarame. Oh, so we literally just have to go. Central Street. I don't remember seeing a house. Alright, let's go. Suguru Kamashida, former Olympian. Try again to refresh him. Teacher at Shujin Academy. Reason for turning himself in is uh, a heavy conscience, huh? Yeah, let's go with that. The human mind doesn't change that easily, let alone their natural temperament. <sighs> Shujin Academy. Seems doubtful. He just backs up and takes a running leap through the window. Perhaps I'll have someone look into it, just in case. Is that it? That is a shit shack. We're at the right address. The door plate does say Matarame. Uh, you ring the bell. Me? The walls won't collapse when I do, will they? This is probably where he makes the students live, and he pretends to live here, but then during the night, he just goes off to his own world of happiness. No one sneeze or we'll blow this house down, okay? Yeah, I'll try not to. No one talk about me. Who is it? Suzuper got the good title. Sensei is currently. Um, it's Takamaki. Mm. I'll be right out. People really do live here. Takamaki. -san. You two are here as well. Okay, you don't have to sound so shit about it. Hey. Hey. Sorry, but uh, we ain't here to talk about the modeling thing. There's something we gotta ask you. Is it true Matarame's plagiarizing stuff? He's abusing people too, yeah? Are you serious? Yes. We read about it online. This? Yeah. <laughs> Preposterous! Not only is the plagiarism impossible, but abuse? If he hated children so much to harm them, he would never allow pupils into his home. This isn't his home. Stop lying. And I'm the one residing here and studying under him. I'm saying it's not true, so it's beyond doubt. Why are you squinting? You might be lying about it. That... Well, shit. I, I didn't think you would actually question me on that. Well, fuck. That is utter rubbish. Fuck. <laughs> I had no family when Sensei took me in and raised me into what you see now. So what you're saying is he groomed you. Got it. That makes it a hell of a lot better. It is pretty big. That's true. If you the house. continue to ridicule the man I owe my life to, you will rue this day. Does anyone win, remember when iCarly had that episode where uh, iCarly's rival, whatever the fuck the guy's name was, he mentioned the word Rue, and all the characters were like, Rue, what does that word mean? And they spent like an entire time looking it up, or like he had to explain it to them. And literally everyone in the audience, including me, was just like, fucking, really? you don't know what that means? Shit, really? You really think that? Yusuke. Hey, Matarame, it's the cut. What's the matter? Self. I heard you yelling. These people are slandering you with baseless rumors. Forgive them, Yusuke. They must have heard some bad rumors and came in worry for their friend's safety. 
Understood, Sensei. Well, even I doubt that a cranky old man like myself could be liked by everyone. That's not what we meant. I'm sorry to have butt in on your conversation. <clears throat> However, I do have neighbors around. Won't you please keep it down? Yes, sir. I mean, your house like overtakes now, several neighbors' excuse slots. Me? <clears throat> that was discourteous of me. I'm sorry. Oh, he's I'm, really whipped. I think you'll be able to believe in Sensei if you saw that painting. It's his maiden work, as well as his most representative piece. It's titled Sayuri. Sayuri? Sayuri? That's the wrong spelling, anyway. This was the painting that inspired me to become an artist. Hmm. It's so beautiful. What if you hung on the screen long enough, his phone battery would eventually drain? And if it got to zero, it, like, completely altered the story? I don't know all this fine art stuff, but even I can tell that this is impressive. When I first saw you, I felt the same powerful emotion as when I saw this painting. Me? I wish to pursue beauty like this. Hmm, coming right out and saying it. This guy must have guts at least at level three. And I believe drawing you will be part of that pursuit. I implore you, seriously consider my offer. I'm sorry that you took the time to come all this way, but I must assist Sensei today. I hope that we can discuss this further another time. If you'll excuse me then. I am going to go receive 30 lashings. Perhaps an extra five, considering today's events. Those two seem like nice guys, don't they? Maybe the Matarame we heard about in Mementos is a different person. That would be Man, weird. right when we thought we found a new target, too. How's the Metanav? Oh, no. Hey, the app. Was it picking up our conversation? This display. It means that Matarame has a palace, too, right? But why? Matarame, plagiarism, and then Shaq, huh? These seem to be the keywords. For real, though, what the hell's going on? Please, Ryuji, stop. Does an old man like him really have a palace? I imagine that old men would have, like, the biggest palaces. They've had a whole lifetime to make them. We have the person's name and the location. All that's left is the what that Madarame mistakes the Shaq for to enter his palace. What that Madarame? You mean like how Kamoshida thought the school was his castle? Yeah. That's right. Let's try saying some things. They can be random guesses. It's a bit sudden though. Why don't we start with castle? No candidates found. Then what about prison? No candidates found. Ah, what a pain. Jail, a warehouse, and guidance counseling office. Might as well add farm. A single hit? What about painting? Should we come back another time? A building that's related to artists. If we think from there, what would it be? That would be a museum. Beginning Got him. Beginning navigation? Whoa, really? Well, here we go. Guidance counseling office. Hey, wait. You don't have anything to guide. Hey, when did you activate the nav? You surprised me. Didn't have much of a choice. I think we just happened to get it right. What if I hadn't noticed and then wandered off and got caught by an enemy? Come on. You probably would have figured out once you started walking on two legs. Yeah. Hey. So even you can slip into the metaverse without realizing it, Morgana? Yep, in a place with minimal cognitive distortion, the differences can be subtle. What? Forget that! Look! That shack is seriously some kind of museum? Hey! Let's go check it out! So extravagant. 
to the point that it's gaudy. Built with fucking gold blocks. It's Some a assholes museum. running the Minecraft server. This is Matarame's? A palace is a scenery driven by desires. Just like how Kamoshida's palace was a castle. Matarame's artwork is on display at museums in reality too, though. His exhibit was popular, and people already respect him. Why would he fantasize about a museum? You got a point. It ain't related to plagiarism or abuse either. Let's try looking around. Racking our brains here won't do us any good. Hmm. Right. Maybe he's like Hitler, and his own art pieces weren't respected, and that's what he wants people to respect. So instead, he's just swiping the artwork from his pupils. Ain't a museum a must for phantom thieves? They're probably traps. Yeah, all those old man's fans were super strong and all. Mm. That has nothing to do with this. <laughs> but man, just look at that insane crowd. It's gonna move on. Yes. Well then, it's time we begin our infiltration. Ugh, are we gonna have to wait in that gigantic line? Don't be stupid, we're not going in the front door. But there's a high wall around the building. We'll just have to find our way up and over it. In any case, let's get going. Alright, let's go see what's actually over here. Wait, head back, did that say? Yeah, we don't want to head back. Hmm? Can these guys not see us? Don't get too close to them. They're probably just distracted by the thoughts of the great painter. Come on, let's go. Oh, I actually got over the line. That's funny. Alright. Yeah, that's what I figured. Anything else to see? No. See it. Yep. This really is how he thinks of that rundown shack. It's overwhelmingly shiny. It's not just hitting repeat that, please, miss. Uh guess we don't get a repeat for that. Oh, I guess we don't get a repeat for that either. I guess I'll just make up my own words. It's overwhelmingly shitty. You could probably wipe your ass on it. Yeah, that'd be totally cool. Hey, you want to go out later? No. Alright, there you go. That was my uh, interpretation of that scene. Uh, I think I was pretty accurate. Mementos uses Kamashita's theme, I'm pretty sure. That's weird. House is okay music. Yeah. Yeah, the palace music has been surprisingly underwhelming so far. They're not something. terrible, but compared to what some of the other tracks are, like just the outer world theme, like behind the mask, that's really fucking good. I have A sooty kettle. Well, we can climb on top of that. Anything else? Let's actually go see what was over here. Is it just a bunch of upkiss? This exhibit is now closed for today. We await your return on another date. Hey, there's some more guards down here. Just two of us won't be able to deal with this whole crowd. Oh. This is our chance. Looks like security's focused on the front entrance. That means there'll be less of them elsewhere. Let's go. Security's tied at the front entrance. We should probably pass them ahead in another way. Three guards isn't exactly what I would consider very tight. But thanks anyway. Jump that way. We jump this way. Life stone. Pretty good. Mm, we can keep going on, or we can check what's up here. Oh, let's just go up. Okay. See if we can't get the jump on that loser. It's somewhere. Oh, there's actually nothing to jump on. Let's keep moving then. I can feel it. I can feel it. There's a skylight. Hey! Ooh, skylight's open. I think we can get in here. But it's a pretty far drop. We'll be able to get back out this way? Hehe, <laughs> don't worry. I have a rope. I'm a tool specialist, after all. So what's your call, Joker? Want to head inside? Yeah, let's do this. Pals and onwards all have varying levels of good. Okay. How suspicious. 
It's quiet. Almost too quiet. Hey, this... It's moving. Come on, we're in a palace. There ain't anything to be freaking out over. Hmm. The palace reflects its ruler's heart. We may want to check these paintings out. Focus. Pearl. I guess old man has a fucking huge palace, too. 